pretty much out on a limb right now with using a concept that's not widely known and it's also not widely covered and it's a widely asked question that nobody seems to have the answer for for example this one guy was saying I have an alternator powered by a gasoline engine I want that alternator to put out a low enough amperage to charge my boat's deep cell batteries how would I be able to throttle the amount of amps going to my battery so I don't burn out the deep cell batteries which have very sensitive requirement on how much amps they can take on a charger and everyone's advice just get more batteries that way your alternator won't burn them out wrong the other advice just wire up a bunch of light bulbs in series that ought to cut it down on amps by providing more resistance wrong that's very inefficient you're just wasting light bulbs and wasting power the proper answer should have been this stick a mosfet controlled by an arduino or microcontroller onto the output of your alternator and have it switch on and off really fast and that will e in effect throttle the current to whatever you need it to be for your batteries um, if the MOSFET can't handle the current flow needs you could use a relay as well but I don't know if relays would be fast enough to get the granularity you'd need to not have the on portion of the on off cycle be too much high amp flow during that on portion to damage the battery but most likely it'd be fast enough I think to even handle in that situation because I think relays are fairly fast but if you could get it to go through a MOSFET that's designed to handle a large enough power and voltage you should be fine and I think they would actually yeah I think they would because the alternator was, was producing 14 volts enough to charge a typical car battery it was a car alternator and so having a MOSFET switch on and off really fast um, would work because the 14 volts would be fine for a 20 volt rated MOSFET which is pretty much a standard rating like mo a lot of MOSFETs can handle that L let me see here what my MOSFETs are that I've bought um, for my switch switch mode power supply let's see yeah an IRF 3205 is 110 amps 55 volt end channel MOSFET you could use one of those because it's rated for up to 110 amps and 55 volts you're only sending in 14 volts from your alternator for your car and by switching it on and off really fast you'll be fine it can handle 110 amps to to charge up your um, three or four deep cycle batteries let's say you need like three to five amps each that's 15 amps this can handle 110 amps you're fine so an IRF 3205 110 amp 55 volt end channel MOSFET would have been the proper answer for how to throttle and manage the current coming off of his alternator to charge his deep cell batteries for his boat and um, all he needed to do is connect that MOSFET in series with his alternator running to the batteries and then set up a microcontroller to turn it on and off at the correct ratio to get the amount of the desired amps so if you'd want it to be um, one third of the voltage so 14 divided by 3 which is like 4.5 if you want it to be 4.5 amps one third of the voltage you would have it on one third of the time off two thirds of the time it'd be the same as a 3 ohm resistor except it, it has a much higher wattage rating than a 3 ohm resistor a 3 ohm resistor with the amount of watts you'd need would be an enormous resistor and it'd be burning off a lot of heat Whereas on and off, you're not really burning off heat. It's just off. That doesn't create a lot of heat. So it's actually more efficient than just putting in a standard resistor. It's just an on-off switch that's acting as a, a form of a resistor by throttling the current. It's not going to create all that heat. 
Man, you know what? I should go on that forum and respond to that guy. Because I have the proper answer, and somebody else might see that question in the future. And I, I'm i the one guy that knows the real answer. Nobody else is going to do this. This is important to me. I have to fix the internet. Headlight, alternator, raft, trip, dock, current, amps, deep south. How do you limit amps for charging? So here we go. This is that forum post I was talking about. Oh, I gotta create an account though. I wonder if anybody brings it up. I'll just search for the word MOSFET. Not there. Not on the first page. Not on the second page. None of them! Six pages of responses, not a single person on this forum mentioned a MOSFET. I can't be bothered to sign up for the forum. Dang it. And it's a 10 year old question. Well, hopefully, my YouTube channel will answer people who have that kind of question. <laughs> 